Eyo 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 what's poppin everybody inakwaje watu wangu e bwana karibuni what's poppin au sio bwana chukua sekunde zako kadhaa piga subscribe kwenye the web tv au sio bwana alafu kishamaliza e bwana mimi wananitaga u n d e r s q o ama ukiwa na raka sana hivi unaweza kanita underscore au sio bwana unaweza kanifuatilia pia <laughs> e bwana leo kwenye maisha ya kawaida kuna watu fulani hivi waga wanachukua time yao wanatuchekesha wanafanya maisha yetu yanakuwa rahisi au sio bwana e bwana leo niko na one of my favorite comedians kabisa kuwahi kutokea hapa nchini Kenya au sio bwana ladies and gentlemen at this jojo habari <laughs> zenu <laughs> mambo poa sana unaongeaga hivi like hivi ndio waga ukisalimia mtu ukipatana naye njiani unamsalimia hivi eh sinaongea hivi kama ulikuwa unafikiria na fake <laughs> e kwanza kwanza mimi ni shabiki wako mkubwa sana from way back yani from ile siku ya kwanza mimi ndo nimekuona pale Churchill nilitokea tu kukupenda eh, ukweli serious very serious <laughs> shabiki ni fan eh shabiki <laughs> Oh, pleasure. Pleasure. Eh, una mimi personally wacha nisiongelee kila mtu. Unanichekeshaga sana yani ni ni nakupenda yani tuseme hivyo. Umesema I'm among the funny ones. You you are the funniest. Say I'm among the funny ones. Thanks, thanks. Sasa sasa mimi nataka nijue nataka tukufahamu leo. Watu wanakuwa na tu pale Churchill ama kwenye stage zingine hizi. Nataka nijue kwanza at this Jojo kule kwetu Jojo ukisema Jojo ni Jojo inamaanisha mtoto mrembo. Jojo kwamba Jojo Jojo. Unaelewa? Hii Jojo yako inamaanisha nini? Jojo ni Joan. Unajua anaitwa Joan Adhiambo. Okay. So Adhiambo is for this na Jojo is for Joan. Oh. Yes. Hivyo nice. ndo Jojo imetoka. Sasa hata okay. msichana mrembo. Hiyo <laughs> ni ile yetu sasa. Yeah. Sasa um, ulianzia wapi? Maana watu mimi personally mm-hmm. mara ya kwanza nimekuwa na chache. Sawa? Nataka tujue ulianzia wapi? Ile kwamba ndo mara ya kwanza umeanza kuchekesha watu. Mm, si nilianza tia chache. Ndio ile stage yako ya kwanza ile? Yes the jengo ya kwanza uh, me guess some things are inborn okay. but sasa mi sita kudanganya ati you used to be funny nikiwa shule <laughs> even though nikifika uni some of my friends realize that eh nilikuwa na entertain not okay. through stand up but na my story too so most of them used to tell me niende chachil niende chachil but unajua sasa kwa pale nje that ka small fish and then you yes. see chachil show it's too big of a stage yeah, to be in yeah. so nilikuwa na shtuka i really took some time before deciding was a final wacha niende chachil but nilitoka tu kampo nikadifa kama nimekuja audition direct chachil show wacha mm na ulipita tu maana kile kuna story fulani waga tunasikia mtu anaenda na rudishwa miaka kadhaa we ile ya kwanza kwamba ndio umeenda kwa audition ulipita nirudishwa miaka tatu wacha <laughs> never lose hope <laughs> miaka mitatu mm, nilikuwa nakuja naambiwa rudi tu bado fanya rudi rudi pika pika jokes zako <laughs> but then unajua mu sema by the end of the day kama Mungu alisema this thing will be yours itakuwa yes. so sikuwa lose hope nilikuwa okay. nashinda tu nimekuja Wow, mm. miaka mitatu alafu kuna watu fulani hivi mtu akienda ile ya kwanza kisha rudisho ya kwanza na lose hope. Yeah, wasani wengi wana losing hope, but if you really want something you should lose hope. Like if you know you're good at it. Yeah, yeah. So I lose hope. Eh, hey, school lose hope. Nikwa naandika jokes bwana, naandika jokes na kuja naambiwa hata hakuna punch line. <laughs> <laughs> na rudi. Haitutekeshi <laughs> rudi. <laughs> eh. What? Yeah. Kwa after miaka mitatu ndo ukapata nafasi ya ku ndo tukumekuona ile samara ya kwanza. Eh yeah, ndio nikakuwa na hiyo breakthrough. Ta three years. Wow. Oh. Ah. Majama kwa hiyo ni funze jamaa. Msi give up vitu vitu vingine kama ni chako ni chako tu itakuja. It doesn't matter the time, si ndio? Mm. Sasa at this jojo um umekuwa among the top female comedians. Mimi naweza nikasema hivyo. Ah uh, wewe unahisi kwamba manake ratio ya wanaume na wanawake ni kidogo wanaume ni wengi kuliko especially tukiongelea comedy. Yes. Unaweza kwamba hiyo imeletwa na nini? Kwamba kwa nini wasichana ni kidogo kwenye industry ya comedy? I can't really say wasichana ni wachache because <coughs> wasichana ni wengi. Okay. It only takes time for people kujulikana. Alafu what I can say is madem unajua sasa sisi <laughs> madem tunapitia. <laughs> Unaona ukienda pale I don't know what happens with men with women but unajua wanaume amnanga challenges mingi sana. Yes. Because you see people want to take advantage of you through every step. Mm. 
mwaso wa wasani every usani waimbaji no. comedians content creators sawa online utapata before vuke mahali someone no. wants to take advantage of you in one way, in no. one way or another no. so unapata most wasani or some females unapata mm-hmm. The time you've agreed to be taken advantage of it's so hard for you to push yes. brand yako no. because unapata mtu alikusaidia maybe atakutoka atafute mtu mwingine mm. and ukifika hiyo point alafu si madem unajua we don't know how to deal with rejection so no. much so unapata you don't have that heart to Yes. Kupush. But there are female comedians out here. I also know some that ni hawajakuwa tu kwa limelight but they'll be. Yeah, Even though it, kila mtu ana time. Yeah. Nayo ni ya wanaume <laughs> wengi. Sisi ni wachache but kila mtu na time yake vile tu umesema. Naam. Uh, apart from um hiyo 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 kwamba wasichana ni, ni wachache kwenye industry mm. kuna kuaga na ile kwamba once umeshatokea ama uko kwenye sasa kwenye mainstream ile kwamba watu wamekujua E, mashabiki ama watu tu waga wanasema mtu kama sasa hivi kukutana naye ama usikie tu kwamba mtu anasema adi squeeze na ringa kwa sababu ashakuwa star waga una deal nayo vipi okay eh hiyo na iko a lot sana but unajua what happens i don't know how kenyans are but you know in this world you cannot please everyone who yes. is please kila mtu no. alafu unaona like now that unaona mimi what happens to me ni Once you are a celebrity in Kenya, wa Kenya huanza kukuvia vitu tofauti. No. So, wewe pia unashindwa hata kuji express mbele ya watu mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. Kenyans are like huyu sasa ako na do. Huyu afai kufanya hii, huyu afai kuenda hapa, huyu afai kuwa hapa, mm-hmm. unaona? No. So, if people already have your feeling about you, I mean, how are you supposed to act normal with them? I love them. Kuna wale watu mlikuwa nao mabeshte but not that close. Mm-hmm. But now when you are known, kila mtu anataka kuja identify now. You cannot be everyone's friend. It's true. Alafu sasa unajua pia watu wanakuanga tofauti. Unaweza salimia mtu apendi kusalimiwa kose kukusalimia. Mhm. Plus wasa, kuna watu wengine wana expect nikipita, wana expect mimi niende ngetuko watu wa ndudo be habari zenu. <laughs> I'm like see wajui. Hey. So they are saying hi. Eh at least kwa nini unakuanga na madharavi? I'm like sasa nitembee tu kila mahali nijinde nimesalimia kila mtu. Expect Uh, nafikiri na expectations za Kenya huaga ziko juu they are too high for yes. celebrities yes. hai tunakipitia we tunakipitia but ni life so waga una deal nayo hivyo kwamba mtu akwambia hivyo una, una ile unalenga tu ama mulenga munyamaza tu because i know there are some some of my people who know sinanga madharau yes so you cannot please everyone musa mtu ah kama anataka kufikiria hivyo acha afikirie tu but <laughs> life has to go on na una otherwise okay, <laughs> okay. sawa so, uh, kutokea ile wakati kwamba ndo ume, ume join Churchill na mpaka sasa hivi. Eh unaweza kusema sasa hivi kwamba kitu gani kikubwa ambacho umefanya? Manake eh, reason na kuuliza hivyo ni kwa sababu kuna ndugu zetu hapa Tanzania ama Nigeria mtu baada ya kama miaka miwili mitatu hivi wanakuja na tuonyesha kwamba eh mimi nimenunua mansion ama nimenunua gari fulani ya pesa nyingi. Wewe ni what are you proud of? ambao ume achieve tangu umeingia church mpaka sasa hivi. Okay, mimi honestly I have so many things to be proud of. Mm-hmm. But when it comes to vitu zenye nimefanya home, um I don't like showing them to people. Okay. Yeah. Mimi sitaki kuonyesha tu oh nilienda nikajenga nimebai. I don't mm-hmm. want to show that part of my life to people. Okay. Literally, mm-hmm. I don't because unaona hapa hapa nje not everyone means well. Yes. Unajua hivyo. So mimi my accomplishments I still have a long way to go. So I cannot be too proud say although I'm proud of the things I've done but I cannot be too proud to be telling people oh I've done this mm. I've done this because I know I have a long way to go and still I have a lot to build. Okay. But usifikiria kuna kitu nimefanya siko mingi zitakushtua. Mimi waga na chimba chimba waga na chatafuta tafuta lakini mpaka sasa hii sijaona lakini yeah. utaona na... kwa sababu nimeamua nisionyeshe. Okay yes. unataka hiyo part ibaki private. Yeah nataka hiyo part ibaki private kidogo tu until I reach ile place nasema eh sasa hii hata ukionyesha unaona what happens with life. I'm not saying mtu anaweza rudi nyuma. Okay. But when you hurry kuonyesha watu you what you built alafu ikuje ni semi yanguke unajua inakuanga way was yes. than unge relax to you build issue and then show so people when you cannot go back uh, yeah even though some you prefer okay so wise very very <laughs> i know <laughs> ningesema una akili lakini utasema ni makutusi lakini una akili uh, manake ni, ni, ni watu kidogo sana ambao wanaweza wakaficha manake hiyo ni kama kuficha hivi mpaka yeah. kitu ndo kimekuja kimetokea alafu ndo unaonyesha watu hasa nataka tuongee kuhusu this jojo foundation mi mi, mi waga ni mpekuzi mpekuzi sana nikipita kwenye page zako hivi niliona this jojo foundation 
nataka tuongelee at this jojo foundation ni nini okay mhm yeah at this jojo foundation nilisaidiwa kufungua na um, i was advised by my manager Okay. Aliniambia nifungue foundation at least that will be there for uno na our my street children this orphans at least a foundation that can raise something to help our watoto wako need hapa nje but still your foundation is not only focusing on that okay. pia tuna focus on unaona this ee kukulea kwa madem like i told you madem sisi kuwa na challenges mingi sana no, no. so the moment you start a foundation that can at least help them help them know their rights help them fight their rights at least so that huko mbeleni to see have kuwa taken advantage of no. plus that foundation is also built on kwenda kwa hizi mashule kwenda kuongelesha wase plus ku discover talents za wasani no pale shule wale watoto unajua there is so much talent out here that is not discovered yet so that foundation is aimed at that yeah i've not officially opened it but okay. eco in the process of being opened na very soon everyone will be able to see what's going on hey umeka ni mongea ni kwa serious mpaka na feel see me me jesus <laughs> nikitu nikitu kizuri sana nataka tujue but yeah, okay. that foundation no. is is it's targeting a lot okay. apart from targeting on providing at least kutembelea this inaitwaje orphanage yeah. uh, our my street children yeah. alafu pia ina ina aim pia atujasahau boy child pia so unajua kuna men also have their rights so yes, yes, yes. empower na wake until we see okay. you people as nothing i'm like who boy ananiambia but they to was how i actually had a guy complain that wamefungwa foundations za madem peke yake and they are forgetting men also need to be listened to so that foundation will cover both though the female Umetuskiria. gender a lot nimewafikiria kidogo <laughs> at least wabaye maboxa <laughs> aki mzee aki jamani msikisa yes. sana <laughs> yeah so uh, uh, at this jojo uh, ni mtu ambaye paka sasa hivi nimejua kwamba ni mtu private sana yes actually uh, vitu vyako vingi uviweki to the public hey, uh, una una eh hewani hey. <laughs> uko vizuri <laughs> uko sawa mimi nimechagua misiweke vitu vingi hewani sawa sawa nimekuja tu mimi sa. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Mi nataka nataka uh, unijibu ile swali maana yeah. kama nilivyokuambia mimi napekua pekua sawa haki si mmepekua sana nilikuwa na mwanangu fulani hapa <laughs> upekuzi <laughs> upekuzi uko vizuri msiana anajua Kiswahili jamaa anajua sasa kwenye upukizi upekuzi wangu mm-hmm. juzi nilikuwa na interview fulani hapa na mwanangu fulani yeye mm-hmm. Falcon Falme rafiki yangu sana anapiga mziki na uh, anapiga ma production na nini tukapiga story zetu au sio bwana lakini kwenye page yake mm-hmm. au sio nikapata kuna picha yenu fulani wewe na ye sawa mm-hmm. uh, alafu kuna caption fulani pale ameandika kwamba something big coming soon na, na, kama sijakosea sasa mimi kwa sababu alikutag sio nikaku nika click pale nikaenda kwenye page yako nikaona ile ile picha kuna picha kama ile zinafanana sawa <laughs> wewe pia umempost ehe mimi mpekuzi aise sawa kuna picha kama ile ile umepost na pia wewe naye caption yako ni kama kwamba kuna kitu hivi kinakuja kwanza nataka utuambie hmm. ni project gani hiyo ambayo mko nayo na Falcon Fund Okay, um, project niko nayo. I've even posted it on my social media pages. No. Niko na should I call it a production lab label ama okay. nini? But one of the things tumefanya na Falcon ni mm. nimemsign under my label. Okay. Yes, so we have a lot tunapanga kufanya na yeye zingine ziko ziko zinaeditiwa, zingine zinaenda kuproduceiwa very soon, but we've done a lot. Okay, and we are projects. aiming to do a lot. Okay. Yes. So so ni projects kwamba zinakuja. Ni... Why why are you smiling? Whoa. Nataka nikusomee hii caption hapa. <laughs> Jamaa, hii caption imeandikwa hivi. <laughs> Mwanaume ni wako tusazili mko na yeye. Akishatoka ni mali ya mtu. Hii caption ina maanisha nini? Well, so unajua mtu weka caption so that in attract likes. Okay. Why do you Kenyans take everything seriously? Sure. Sasa si ndio maana uko hapa ndio maana uko na mimi ndio maana uko na anda siku hiyo nataka ajue na mashabiki zetu pia wajue. Hii caption mbona kama haiendani na ile ya kwake aliyopost. Ile yake ilikuwa inasema kwamba kazi zinakuja. Yes. Lakini yako nataka nikusomee tena. Imande kwa hivi. Mwanaume ni wako tu saa zile mko na yeye akishatoka ni mali ya kila mtu. Alafu kamtag pale. Sasa umeanza kuopa thing. <laughs> <laughs> Kama wa Kenya wote. Your caption niliyeka to attract viewership. Okay. Yes, but then we have a lot to work with Falcon. 
but you never know. No so sasa kesho ujuange. Sawa. Yeye ni namba hivi. Um ni kazi sawa. Mm-hmm. Kuna ngoma ambayo mlifanya nini mm-hmm. eh, lakini idea kwanza ilitoka kwako yes. which is a good thing. Yeah, na nikamuuliza kwana na, yes yes alinambia unaandika kama scripts nini yes. which is a good thing. Akanambia kwamba ni kazi. Unikabe tu na maneno ya kunywa soda. Kunywa soda manake hapa pana tunapokwenda hapa ndio patamu zaidi hapa. Kunywa soda kwanza. Jama at this. Yonya soda yake pale lakini pitia pale kwenye page yake utaona vitu pale okay. amemtag mwana. Sasa mbali na hapo. Kwenye hiyo hey, page yako. Wa Kenya wako nayo serious. Kwenye hiyo page yako at this. Ah uh-huh. uh, juzi eh, kama siku siku 4 tano hivi zimepita. Uli post pale mm-hmm. kuandika hivi kwenye Instagram page yako your latest post usaenda ukaifuta. <laughs> Uliandika hivi jamaa nataka ngwasomee. <laughs> Mwanaume akiniambia hivi na toa nguvu ya kumwacha watu. <laughs> Watch song in YouTube link iko kwa bio ya Falcon Mfalme. Mimi ninavyojua Falcon ameachia ngoma. Mm. Sawa. Lakini hii video, manake ni video. Mm-hmm. Sawa. Wa Kenya wataenda pale wataangalia. Mko na yeye pale, kwamba ni kama TikTok fulani hivi, una support ngoma yake. Lakini kuna ma- mshiko mshiko fulani hivi mmeshikana pale. Hasa kama huyu ni msanii wako mm. ambao umemsign kwenye label yako. Inamaanisha wewe si bosi wake? <laughs> Sasa inakuwaaje msanii na bosi wake? Kwani wewe ni Diamond na Zuchu? Wasanii wa si dance na bosses. <laughs> ah, hiyo tuliachia Simba na Zuchu. <laughs> ah, si we are sisi ni Simba na Zuchu wa Kenya. <laughs> oh, kama ni hivyo ni sawa. We are trying to keep it real. Ulikuwa ngoma kama hiyo, ulikuwa nataka ni dance niko huko, yeye yeah, kwa huku, tuna dance ni kama tunaenda huko. <laughs> <laughs> kushikana lakini hatushikani. Okay sawa. Kwa hiyo kwa hiyo ni biashara. Okay. Yes. Kama ni biashara, mm. sawa. Ah uh, which is a good thing. Msani. Ni nataka utoke na namba yangu hapa. So you are really insisting. <laughs> eh bwana, mimi kama mimi ni pamoja na wakili. <laughs> mimi I am representing. Nilikuja hapa. I so but, but I am not into men with dreadlocks. Waacha. Ah ah. Na vile wanatupenda huku nje? Ah ah ah. Kwanza wanazishika shika hivi wanasema kwa ndani. Mimi naye. Ah ah. Waacha. Ni sawa. Ni sawa this. Ah hiyo tumeelewa. Uh, Falcon Falme ni msanii mzuri sana if you're supporting him. Yes. Keep up. Uh, na tunatarajia hizo projects kwamba zitakuwa nyingi. Sasa mimi nataka uonge na um, kuna comedians eh, especially wa kike ambao wanahisi kwamba mimi nataka nikishaenda pale chachi ama nikishapiga nikishaeka vitu vyangu social media mm. kwamba iende ile kwamba itoboe yani wewe ndo ashapata tobo ile kwamba yani ashakuwa star. Mimi nataka uongeleshe manake kuna watu ambao wanaamini kwamba hu, kama ulivyosema wewe ilikuchukua miaka mitatu ndo kwamba sasa tumekuja tumekuona. Kuna watu wanataka wakishafanya ile content yao ya kwanza iende tayari. Sasa mimi nataka uongeleshe especially the female. Actually in your point nilikuwa naangojea <coughs> Sitaongea kama only a comedian because okay. I'm also an actor. Yes. Pale Ramogi TV. Mm-hmm. And I am also a content creator. Yes. Meaning move a content social media. So I'm all, I'm no I'm only not a musician which yes. I can be. So what I can tell wasani hapa nje be it a content creator, comedians or actors. Mi yes. kitu naweza sema mtaanza na madem but still it will cut across. Yes. One thing I'll tell you it's so easy to build a brand. It's really easy to be famous because sasa hii unajua with corona family kuja tu hivyo like yes. someone who just trend on TikTok na boom anajulikana Amen. kila mahali. But then what will you do with that fame? Yes. Unajua Kenya squeeze or brother in the whole world mostly Kenya jina huenda juu mm. mfuko inabaki chini. Mm. So what I know first of all never lose hope if you know you're good in something. Usi why Luzo plus usia yeye kama mtu akukontrola kwambie this unafufanya hivi fanya hivi na msingoje like there is a lady i met another day so at this naomba namba yako i want to start doing content na sijui nianze api nataka mtu anishike mkono mm-hmm. musi why fikiria ati ukishikwa mkono ndo utaomoka mm-hmm. ati you need someone who is already famous to hold your hand yes. ukiwa na content and you, um, you can act it well post it kwa social media page yako because you never know content yes. gani itaenda na you never know who's watching you here. never know who is watching sasa yes. mtu kwa mentality yenu at you have to have someone aku hold mkono ndio uomoke mm. mimi nilijitoa shule sitakuambia nilala wapi juni nitaseka eh sitaki urumie <laughs> nilijitoa ld moi 
okay. nikakuja huku Nairobi and nikajipeleka audition all i needed all i did was to make sure najua cha till show auditions ziko wapi mm-hmm. nilijipeleka hivyo in fact nakumbuka madem walikuwa nafikiria mimi ni walikuwa nafikiria mimi uongea poem they never thought i'm a comedian by the way okay. ni menyamaza uh-huh. but what i'll tell madem apa enjoy kuna hiyo ya usiwahi fikiria utashikwa mkono ndio uomoke if you have something posted pale tuone mm-hmm. second there are many people apa enjoy when you are just waiting to how <laughs> naume they just want to Mm. They just want to take advantage of you. If you make that mistake of having anything to do with mtu wako mbele yako in the name of atakufanyia favor, it will never work. Mm-hmm. Work your way through your success on your own without favors. Because I believe kama Mungu alikupangia utaomoka hii time. Hakuna mtu anaweza zuia isi happen. Plus, yes. guys, please learn how to make money out of your name if you are a big brand tafuta njia ya kuitumia kutafuta pesa perfect advice yama perfect advice kama ni mtu wa masikio kama una masikio umesikia haki nimekuwa machua aje haki i need to get married nimefika <laughs> advice 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 ya nguvu tunasema ga hivyo yes. sasa this bwana kabla tumalize mm-hmm. eh, sisi hapa the whip tv waga tuna maswali yetu matano tunaita tano za kizushi umezisikia na niziogopanga aha hizi zako hizi zako ni rais hizi zako ni rais vitu vidogo vidogo vitu rais rais sana ah sasa swali langu la kwanza kwenye tano za kizushi uko tayari niambi hizo maswali before nikuje aha sasa nikikwambia wewe utatafuta tafuta utaanza kutafuta alafu hizi hazinaga eh azinaga kwamba ati maelezo uniambiani kwa sababu ya ah uh-uh. bora hakuna smash or pass ka- ah hakuna ah. amna amna zetu <laughs> za kijanja zetu za kijanja bwana si watu tunafikiria sana hasa swali la kwanza ni rais sana mm-hmm. mimi nataka spell for me onomatopia 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 eh onomatopia yeye eh o n eh eh i don't know onam ah ah i know eh eh twende O N O M A P E I E P A E P A Amempata jamaa Sawa mtatuambia hapo kwenye comment section Watatuambia Asa this waga una 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 prefer nywele fupi ama kama umesuka ama umeshuka Kwa mwanaume ama mimi Kwako Oh nilikuwa nafikiri una hotel za wanaume Na ushaanambia upendi dread kwa sababu ama hapo kwenye dread jamaa tumeumia In as much as short hair looks cute Sitaki maelezo Short or long Oh short or long Long Ta <laughs> Tuenze tu swali letu la tatu. Usijeleze. Usijeleze. <laughs> swali letu la tatu. Napenda mwanaume mfupi ama mrefu? Mrefu. Mimi ni mrefu ujue. Ah. <laughs> Hiyo ningetaka kueleza lakini sawa. Usieleze. <laughs> sawa, usieleze. <laughs> sawa, swali letu la nne. Mm-hmm. Sawa. Hii ni rais. Mhm. Wacha nikuulize kizungu. Do you own any sex toy? Eh hey, no 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 no. Eh hey, riswa, riswa. Pepo mbaya. <laughs> Tema tema eh shetani ashindwe Hamna maelezo hamna maelezo shanijibu uko sawa uko sawa Ah swali letu la mwisho Umekatana nguvu hiyo Sawa swali letu la mwisho Hamna maelezo sawa Mhm Acha nicheke kwanza Ah maliza kucheka la twenze tu Okay Uko sawa Mhm Rubbed ama dry fry Atiamoa Rubbed ama dry fry hiyo rapt ni nini kama ni wet fry ni hiyo ni hiyo at this you have been a dry fry jama mmeipata hiyo saa sasa this mimi nataka undo muda wako nataka uonge na mashabiki zako anything you want to tell them what akupata wapi wa kufuatilia wapi kazi zako zinazokuja just talk to them okay guys tushaongea story ya ile foundation yangu please the foundation's page inaitwa this jojo foundation mnaweza enda hapo mwi follow plus all my social media pages naitwa tu at this jojo please and then pale youtube msubscribe because i have a very interesting series inakuja from next month sitawaambia inaitwa inaitwa nini 
it's a surprise but go and subscribe to my youtube channel remember all my social medias na itwa a this jojo na na wapenda sana na kupenda so wale wanaume wako na gari wenye dread sisi da jamaa tuna bahati e bwana umesikia ngania vitu kwa nyumba na wewe shawa ke <laughs> ya watu naonea sana jamaa hata tuvai uaga shake. Basio, e bwana this asante sana kwa kuja. Mm. Thanks for honoring our invite. Tumepiga ma story, mimi nimefurahi, mimi kama shabiki yako napenda nikikuona na mimi. Mbona mali safi? Mbaya. Ni vile sasa umeshanikataa sasa tutafanyaje? Waja tusonge mbele na maisha. <laughs> e bwana oni at this Jojo, au sio bwana, uh, ametuchekesha. Au sio bwana, apart from kutuchekesha kwenye stage ni mtu mmoja hivi ana ana roho safi au sio ukikutana naye ni vile tu amenikataa lakini mimi ninge au sio bwana <laughs> ebona chukua muda wako sisi tunaitwa the whip tv tufuatilie piga subscribe mwambie na mwanzako aje subscribe manake the whip tv ndo habari ya mjini au sio bwana na mimi wana nitaga u n d e r s q o ama ukiwa na haraka sana hivi unaweza kanita underscore au sio bwana until next time bye